What's going on everyone? I've got the chest hooked up today. That's all it's gonna be. Hold on. The only camera we're gonna have today is the chesty. We're not gonna have the dash cam because I'm in the aluminum boat. See, made out of metal. Kind of weird to think that metal floats in it. But anyways, I'm at a uh, kind of dangerous river. Couldn't put a fiberglass boat in here. We're gonna throw a drop shot around, finesse fish for a while until they turn on the generation. Whenever they, well, when they start to generate, they turn on the water. And whenever that comes on, we're gonna try to skip a frog around some of these bushes. But until then, we're gonna try to catch some on one of my new favorite ways to fish, which is a drop shot. I absolutely love throwing a old spinning pole, even though I don't like doing it in tournaments because it's so slow, but it is fun when I'm fun fishing. I do really like throwing it. So let's go catch some big ones. We are in the aluminum boat today. Gotta wear a freaking life jacket up here. Dude, he's got me so much stuff. This is a big one. Four pounder. Let me get him and make a video. All right, I'll call you back. like a little one well don't feel that little now it's a good one not bad not bad at all that's what I'm talking about that's a good one actually oh don't you come off of here look how pretty they are in that water There's something to be said about these small little hooks like this on these drop shots. You don't lose me fish on them. Get over here, get over here. Boom, look at that. Beautiful little fish. See how these rocks, this is not a good place to be. Dangerous. That's why I'm in an aluminum boat. See if you don't check this out. Barely came off. Hey, you got my, got my hook down your throat. There we go. A little fish two pounder nice i think it's august now yeah nice august bass not bad at all boom didn't have the camera on just had another one by the old drop shot little one but they pretty Ooh. there's one Little but we'll take whatever because it's August and fishing ain't easy. Fishing ain't easy. Hard out here for a fisher. Boom! Little That's what I should expect on a little drop shot in it. Look how pretty they are up here. Dark. Not beat up. This is a special place. The water is on. Two hour window is all we got. The water just came on. Hopefully, we can get over there, skip a frog around, and catch some. I've caught less frog fish this year than I've ever caught in my entire life since I started throwing a frog, which is probably 12 years ago or whenever it came out. So, we gotta catch up today, catch some frog fish. God, that's a big one. Oh, he came off. Oh my goodness. Did y'all see that? That was a freaking five or six pounder. Came up and smashed it right there. 
and I had him on for a long time. Gosh, dog, man. Man, you got around that stick. I don't lose me on this rod because their load's so good, but dang, that was that was a big one. Mm, mm, mm. That was freaking awesome. I thought he was way smaller than that. It's actually a good one. Get up in here. Boom! Finally. I say finally. I've been throwing a frog for about 15 minutes and I lost a six and missed a two and I catch a three. So finally maybe ain't the word. Mm, mm, mm. That's so much fun. Awesome. Oh, he's bleeding. I did hook him in the tongue a little, so I'm gonna go ahead and get him back. This is so much fun. another good one. I got him hooked funny. Boom. Check that out. Mm. Old black frog. Y'all believe me now that I don't care about colors? Every time I go fishing, I take throw a different color, don't I? Alright, we're island back up to the juice now. Last time I was doing this, I had the chest cam zoomed in. I had it on set onto a narrow field of view. So this time, I'm trying to make sure I got better shots than I did last time. So, sorry about that last time. Gonna do better this time. Gosh, man. another good one came up there and freaking crushed it dude that's awesome i do like catching them on a frog yep had y'all running thank goodness because that was a loud bite big time but the way you ate that thing another good one the peak time has already gone the water you can see on the trees over there if you can see that the trees are brown like a foot and a half up. It's already fell a foot and a half in like 30 minutes. So, the good frog time has already passed. We're gonna try to catch one or two more though. Well, gotta put up. Fun day today, kinda. Burnt the trailer motor up uh, about 100 yards in. And now it will, I guess it's a, the switch went out on the foot pedal because when I turn on constant speed, It'll go, but whenever I put it and trying to press the button, it does not go. So that made it kind of interesting. We didn't catch that many fish because of the trailer motor. Or at least that's what I'm blaming it on. So this is pretty much a little hunting boat. My dad takes it to the river to get to some hunting land that other people can't get to as easily. So we don't take it fishing very often unless I take it and put it somewhere where a bass boat should not be. But that's where the big unpressured fish live. So I keep going back to them. Fun nonetheless. The uh, frog I was throwing is a spro frog. That's what I always throw. People always ask what kind of frog I'm using. It's a spro frog. If you want to stock up on them, Sportsman's Outfitter sells them for cheaper than anywhere else I have found. That's where I order all my frogs from. I also caught some on a drop shot, a uh, six inch rubber worm, quarter ounce weight. The current was pretty slow whenever I was throwing the drop shot. So I would toss it out in any, in any kind of holes, behind any kind of current break, any kind of seam, and just kind of let it tumble down in the current. The, the, if you throw a three eighths, it doesn't really drift as much. And it seems like whenever you're fishing, really really finicky current fish whenever the current's not as strong as normal and clear water you want to have it where the current can actually move your bait it just seems to be more natural in the fish bite a little bit better but that current gets up it gets going fast i'm picking the frog up and going to skip with some bushes so did lose that one five and a half or six pounder begging begging for anywhere especially in august hated to lose it but 
It's going to happen from time to time. If you like the video, leave a like, leave a comment, hit the subscribe button. Appreciate y'all watching. Look at that. You know what that's for? That's for hanging up deer. That's how you know it's a deer boat. See y'all.